Whatever time it is, it's Titanic Animal Time, guys. And uh, today I'm bringing you a great gameplay on uh, Jungle in uh, Call of Duty Black Ops, as you know. And um, I think I go 26 and 1. This is a pretty recent gameplay, actually. Um, I think I got it a couple nights ago. And um, I just wanted to talk a little bit about a couple things today. Um, but first off, about the gameplay. Um, if none of you have used the foul, I... Uh, I certainly recommend you try it, guys. I think it's a, uh, a great gun, and I'm sure a lot of people don't use it um, because they don't have maybe a great trigger finger, but I'm in the same boat there, and um, I have definitely never been a great finger mover, if you know what I'm saying, guys. And uh, I think foul only takes a couple, two or three shots to kill an enemy, and if you just move your finger a little bit, you get that quick quickly, so I definitely, definitely recommend using the foul and uh, trying it out. Uh, but this is pretty good gameplay. It's it's pretty action packed. I keep keep the moving around a lot, and um, I think the dogs get a little bit of a uh, little bit of my kills, but mostly it's uh, just my foul doing work. So um, hope you enjoy this gameplay. But I wanted to talk, I wanted to talk about the ladies today, guys, and. Uh, for any of you watching, I think you know that sometimes you can feel a little awkward in front of the ladies because definitely in the beginning of my uh, career in front of the the opposite sex and uh, definitely wasn't completely comfortable being around them and I think I've grown to learn uh, unfortunately that girls are really uh, kind of, I don't know, maybe uptight or... Uh, they're sort of hard asses at the beginning. They don't they don't open up too much, and unfortunately for uh, guys who don't want to be badass and uh, cover their personality, unfortunately a lot of great guys uh, miss out because they just uh, they can't do the badass shit. And what I'm saying here, guys, is um seems like girls girls don't open up too well at the beginning. Uh, pretty much any girl and. The way to combat that, you know, is to uh, be a hard ass, be a badass, and um, I'm not saying to be a complete jerk and, you know, be a douche to a lady, but sometimes you gotta fight rock to rock, gun to gun, because if you ain't bringing your game, it's like being a knife in a gun show, it's bullshit old Joe. But anyways, guys, you got my, uh, you have my story on what I think about the ladies in, uh, in the society today. But, uh, now I want to talk about story time. Story time, guys. It's story time. And, uh, <laughs> we're going to talk about, uh, when I went to the beach with my friends. And, um, my recent commentary also talked about going to the beach. And, uh, I live in Florida, and that's sort of what you do with your friends. You go out to the beach, and you look for hot opposite sex females and um about that um we're at the beach and uh we got a football we always do this uh, a couple of my friends and i we get a football and we do something called fishing and um if any of you ever seen the movie american pie american pie 2 you know stifler and all those uh crazy guys and how they try to get into mischief and and they try to uh to have sex before they get into college and all kind of Crazy things like that. Anyways, it's a movie from the 90s, uh, early 2000s. It's a great movie. You guys should check it out if you haven't. And uh, fishing. What, what, what fishing is, is you pretty much uh, get a friend to throw you a ball pretty much in the same direction as the ladies or the, uh, the women that you are trying to hit on or start a conversation with. And so that was our plan coming in. Uh, we, we just got to the beach, and uh, we went straight into the... Uh, ocean and um amazingly uh we freaking picked up a group of ladies just straight on i mean first five minutes into the water we didn't even have to do fishing we didn't have our bait and tackle even set and they were already on us um it was pretty awesome and a couple of the girls were pretty hot uh one of them in particular was a a very good looking lady a lot of my friends would uh say she was a 10 out of 10 uh, on the the grading scale for uh, purtiness, and um, I'd have to say, I uh, I, w I tried something new. This is probably my first experience was 
was trying to be a badass because as I told you earlier that's sort of uh, what you need to do if you want to get with a woman a girl a lady and uh that's what I did. I sort of acted badass. I had just gotten a uh, mohawk haircut, so I kind of looked pretty cool. I, I got some new clothes. My mommy took me out, and uh, it was pretty awesome. So I felt pretty cool and uh, went out to the ocean, and this one lady was uh, very, very on to me. And um, we can just call her, uh, let's call her Sarah, Sarah Warner. And that was not her name, but... Her name is Sarah Warner, and um, it was uh, great. She's a very, very good-looking lady, and uh, I sort of acted badass. Uh, had a little conversation, you know, or what school do you go to? Where are you from? And um, from there, we uh, we exchanged numbers, and uh, we ended up having a uh, a great uh, relationship. It was a uh, it was great while it lasted, and it was really fun. And uh, from there, I really picked up a lot of confidence about. How you uh, you really need to uh, unfortunately be uh, kind of a hard ass in the beginning of any relationship with a a girl because if you don't, they think that you are a soft guy, and unfortunately, if you have ever heard the phrase "nice guys finish last," and uh, I hate to say it, but that's sort of uh, true, uh, especially with the young ladies these days. And so, if you act badass a little, uh, and you get to know them, you can definitely become a, a nice cuddly little hug bear if you know what I'm saying and uh, that's what I did I'm no badass guys I'm just a dork like I'm, I'm not saying you guys no I, you know I'm I'm kind of a geeky guy I play video games Friday Saturday nights I I do all right at school I'm just sort of a uh, a geek and so um you know trying to act badass is definitely not in my character but um it certainly worked and uh, I like to try it out and uh, it was great. So I just wanted to uh, tell you guys, you know, from my uh, experience, you guys feel your way out. Um, it's definitely a tough world out there, but there's plenty of ladies, plenty of fish in the sea. So um, hopefully you guys learn a little from this. Uh, go out and just uh, try to try something new. So I hope you enjoy this commentary, guys. It's about to wrap up. And um, I, will, uh, I will talk to you guys later. So uh, see you guys. Thank you.